Hey guys, it's your girl Moby and welcome to my YouTube channel. If you are new here, welcome, welcome. And if you are a returning subscriber, I see and I appreciate your support. So guys, I am doing a skincare disclaimer haul, as you guys can tell by the title. And just a disclaimer guys, I'm wearing a bite plate because I've been clenching on my jaws and my whole face just hurts because I've just been in a weird funk. You know, I just, I haven't been okay. <laughs> I haven't been okay, so I've been clenching all my jaws and my face just hurts. So I have to have this in. So if I do talk a bit funny, please just bear with me. Bear with me. I'm I'm really trying here. I feel like I'm not sitting in the middle. Okay. This is better. Yeah. Okay. But anyways, guys, um, this is just an extension of the video that I did for my skincare routine. It's long overdue, I know. But I'm just, this is just going to be a short video, just me telling you guys how much everything is and roughly, you know, where you can get it. Obviously, this came, I said, a disc came more. And um, you can also get it at Clicks. It's just one product that you can't get at Clicks or that I haven't found at Clicks, let me rather say. And yeah, guys, that's just that. So, first of all, I'm recovering from a really bad breakup, guys. I went into hiding because I was just like, there's no way. My face looked terrible. So, I had instant coffee and milk because we ran out of filtered milk. I mean, filtered coffee, right? And the whole week I had been drinking coffee with milk. And one thing about me, when I drink coffee, it's half milk, half half water. So, that's how I make my coffee, guys. Like, I love, I love a creamy coffee type of thing you know so then i had a really bad breakout and also because when i took it at that time i was peer missing right so now it just made everything worse so my skin was red everything was red because there was pimples everywhere then i tried a new product because my mom and i were just frustrated at the fact that the skin is just looking horrible right now i tried a new product and then my face just became worse and I mean, was that there was rash, there was more pimples, there were more red. Yes, in I wish I took a photo so that you guys can see. Like right now, it looks bad. I'm just recovering from these dark spots and stuff like that on my face. But other than that, like my face was looking kind of scary. I won't lie. But anyways, guys, let's get into this haul. But before we get into the haul, if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, please do subscribe um leave a comment down below if you must you know you know tell me <laughs> please join the family please join the family if you haven't subscribed and yeah guys let's get into it so um i can't remember all the prices because when i went to go buy some of the stuff i just was it was an addition to what i already have so i will put the full prices in the description box but roughly i spend around just under let me say 700 rand for everything for my face this is just for my face um yeah just under 700 rand for um, my face products um the most expensive thing is my sunscreen but it does last me quite long i don't buy it that often like every four to six months because i use it sparingly guys when i say i use it sparingly i really do and i test on my face and wash my face like twice a day so i do use it sparingly and it really lasts me quite long so yeah it's worth the price because it does last quite some time but yeah guys i feel like i'm not sitting straight i feel like i'm not sitting straight but you guys will just have to deal with it. You just have to deal with it. So, um, anyways, guys. So, let me start with the face washes. So, I use the Guardian Air Vitamin C range. I use everything except for their sunscreen and their toner. Like, I think it's a medicine. Mm -hmm. That one. You know what I'm talking about. Starts at the end. That toner. That one. That toner, and I don't wear makeup like that, so like I know that a lot of people use that toner when they for for removing their makeup and stuff like that. So I really don't wear makeup like that, so I didn't buy that toner. Um, yeah, and what else? Yeah, basically that. So let's get into it. So this is I use this cleansing foam. I use this cleansing foam. It's about like fifty six rand and also the scrubbers also around that price just under 60 rand 
these two i scrub my face every once in a while like you know when my face is thicker thicker ring so like now like my face is just thicker thicker ring so i will scrub more often and then this um cleansing foam i literally use every day i use it twice a day when i go to sleep and when i wake up in the morning whenever whenever i wash my face really and then I also use this oil control because in my previous video I did mention that I do have really oily skin so when my skin is just overly oily and I can start seeing the pimples forming or whatever that's when I use it because like yeah I have really oily skin so um, naturally even if I don't touch on my face it won't show that I didn't touch on my face that's how oily my skin is so I use this as well so these are the three face washes that I use and I just use them simultaneously like if I use this in the day I'll use this in the night whatever the case may be right so this is also like I think 30 something rand this is the cheapest one the cheapest face wash it's just these ones that are like 50 something rand each and then this is the cheapest one about 30 something 40 something rand right so yeah this is gonna be my thumbnail. <laughs> I think this should be my thumbnail. Let me make my thumbnail. Cheat. I need to retake that. But anyways, um, what else? Okay. So let me get into my toners because I took them out. So um, this is the toner that I was talking about. This toner you can only get at this skin. Well, I've only found at this skin. I haven't found it at Clicks. But everything else you can get at Clicks. Um, so I use this toner. And then I use this toner as well, this rooibos toner. It helps with my pimples as well, just to keep the acne away. Um, this one babas, I won't lie, it babas. And this one sometimes babas when my skin is also thicker, thicker ring, but... Yeah, excuse me, excuse me, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. <laughs> but yeah, this is also a shine control. Like I said, I have oily skin, so this helps with my oily skin, it helps with the pimples. And this is just the normal toner that I would use every other day when my face is just not, you know, acting out, right? Then, um, oh, I didn't tell you guys the prices. <laughs> this is like 45 Rand. And then this is like 60 something Rand, I think. Or 59 Rand, it's 59 Rand. Or 60 something Rand, one of the two. I'll put all the prices in the description box properly so that you can see. But like the prices online and the prices in store aren't the same but yeah um it's like 60 something 50 something rand just over 59 rand i think and then this is one of the most expensive products that are part of my skincare routine is the serum i use the vitamin c serum and this is 185 rand and it lasts me like a month and a half maybe if I'm pushing it because I won't lie to you, I'll be, I'll be, I'll be applying this stuff, I'll be putting it on. So, like, I try to use it sparingly as well because it is that expensive. So, that is that is that this total, yo, the serum. Um, yeah, it really works well for me, so it's just part of the routine. And then I use this Tassa. I use this Tassa um, from the vitamin C range as well. It's for, for oily skin. There is a Tassa for normal skin as well. But I choose the very oily, like it says there. I don't know if you guys can see. It says very oily. And yeah, I use this one because obviously, like I said, like almost 100 times, I have very oily skin. So, But this really mattifies my skin a lot. So then I usually mix it with this Eucerin, this Eucerin sunblock. Um... Garnier does have a sunblock, but the SPF is 30, and I just like to use the highest SPF. So I use the Eucerin one, and it's also oil control, and it helps with my pimples as well to reduce that from happening. It's acne prone and oil control, like you see over there. And this is 280 rands. 280 rands. But it does last me. It does. I think, yeah, this and the serum are the most expensive one out of everything. But it really does last me. So I don't buy it as often. I think I'll buy it like every like four months if I use it properly. Because like when I say guys, I use it as pea size. I mean like pea size. This is how much I would use. And then mix it with my tassa. And I obviously use more of that one because my skin is oily. Like I said, even if I don't tassa my skin... 
it will show like it won't show that i didn't salsa like my the oiliness will come out type of thing so i use as little as possible because you know but it still works and i use it twice a day so yeah this is like 250 280 rand it was it was 250 but now it's 280 rand Cha. <laughs> like the cost of living now what am i gonna do with this but anyways, um, yeah, the cost of living is just becoming ridiculous right now. But yeah, guys, that's essentially what I use. This is what, like, I bought these stuff, like, a few days ago. And um, it's, like, seven items, and I spent 440 rand on those items. The only items that are not for my face is the roll-on. Oh, yeah, the roll-on and then um, the cotton pads. So this toner, the rooibos toner is 67 rand. Child, child, 67 rand, sorry. But like I said, I'll put the, the, the prices in the description box so that you guys can see how much everything is. And yeah, guys, I hope that you guys enjoyed this short, brief, very brief video as an extension of my skincare routine that I did post quite a while ago. So this is just giving you guys the prices of what it is and like where you guys can get it from both this kim and clicks so yeah guys um i hope that you guys enjoyed that and hope that it was informative and also guys one thing you guys must remember please be patient with your skin one thing i learned in the past few weeks because my skin was just thicker thickering is please i beg don't bombard your skin with products when your skin is breaking out like that because it just makes it worse and i should have just let my skin be because now it took so long and it is taking so long for my skin to recover now i have all these dark spots on my skin you know um now it's taking quite long for my my skin to recover and get back to what it used to be so yeah watch what you eat sorry this pipe place is just doing a lot watch what you eat um don't bombard your skin with products you know when it's breaking out just relax let it be you know but like i was just getting really frustrated at seeing so many pimples on my face like and they were so red and like it was just it was just out there so i just knew i didn't like it at all but anyways guys i hope that you guys enjoyed that please do not forget to subscribe if you haven't already give this video a big thumbs up and guys i will see you in my next video